Hi, I'm Joe with Family Handyman. Today I'm going to show you how to install composite decking using deck clips. If you're looking for a clean surface with no visible screw heads, you'll want to try this deck clip. There are several deck clips on the market today. I'm sharing with you the Camel Edge and the Camel Edge X clip. You can use these clips on any degree pattern. Great for putting your boards on an angle. Before you get started, you want to check your local building codes and pull a permit on your project. Your first board is your most important board. You can choose to start it at the house or out on the rim. I chose to start mine on the rim because I'm going to need to rip the last board. The first board you're going to want to use starter clips. It's going to set up the layout of your deck boards and achieve that clean look you're looking for. To install the clips, the edge clip you simply slip over the joist for the edge X clip, squeeze the wings together and slide it into the place. To notch around the board, place the board tight against the post. Take a square, place it on the surface of the board, push it up tight against the post and pull it back a little bit. Make your mark. Do the same on the other side. Pull it back, draw your line, make a mark. Getting the depth of it, place a clip into the groove of your previous board. Place the board up against the clip. Now, add your square, make your line. To notch it out, you'll want to use a jigsaw. The beauty of using these camel clips is you can load up a whole run on the board and cut your time in half. Since we're using camel clips, we're going to use the camel lever. They simply slip it over the joist, lock it in place, and you turn the lever and it pushes your board tight against the clip, giving you a perfect gap. When fastening the clips down, you want to use a drill with a clutch, not an impact driver. You don't want to overdrive the screws. You'll pick up time with these clips and using these levers, especially if you're working by yourself. As you continue to lay boards down on your deck, you may run into a situation where you have two board's ends butting together. This is called a butt joint. You want to minimize the gap. You don't want to have a gap in there. And you want to use two joists when you have a butt joint and attach them with four clips. For more great decking ideas, visit us at FamilyHandyman.com.